Hello, this is Not Your Chem Tutor, and in this video, I will teach you how to solve mass per volume percent. Mass per volume percent is one of the many expressions of solution concentration. In this video, I also included three examples so you can practice some calculations. In order to answer questions about mass per volume percent, you must know how to do dimensional analysis. If in case you are not familiar with dimensional analysis, you can check the description box. I will put there a link to my video. Mass per volume percent is also known as percent mass over volume. And the formula is percent mass over volume of solute is equal to mass of solute divided by volume of solution times 100. And the mass of solute the unit must be in grams, and the volume of solution must be in ml. Let's answer example 1. A 50 ml aqueous solution of sodium sulfate contains 2 grams of sodium sulfate. What is the solute concentration in percent mass over volume? So in this problem, sodium sulfate is our solute. And our solvent is water. When you encounter this word aqueous, this means the solvent is water. So we will use the formula. Percent mass over volume is equal to mass of solute in grams. We are given 2 grams of the solute. Divided by volume of solution in ml. And we are given 50 ml of the solution. So 2 divided by 50 times 100. This is equal to 4%. Mass over volume. Example 2, a chemist is tasked to prepare a 40% mass over volume aqueous solution of sucrose. What mass of sucrose is needed to make 0.230 liters of solution? So in this problem, sucrose is our solute and water is our solvent because the solution is aqueous. We will still use the formula. But this time, we are given the percent mass over volume, which is 40%. So 40, that is equal to mass of solute in grams, which is not given. So just write mass of solute divided by volume of solution. In our problem, we are given 0 0.230 liters of solution. And we need ml. The formula says we need ml. So we need to convert 0 0.230 liters to ml. One liter, as we know, is equivalent to 1,000 ml. So liters will cancel. So 0 0.230 times 1,000, this is equal to 230 ml. So this is the volume of the solution in ml. So you put 230 and then times 100. So to solve for the mass of solute, what you need to do is to divide both sides of the equation by 100. So 100 will cancel on the right side. And what remains on the right side is mass of solute divided by 230. And on the left side, you have 40 divided by 100. That is 0 0.4.
Then you multiply both sides of the equation by 230. 230 will cancel on the right side. And what remains on the right side is mass of solute. And on the left side, you have 230 times 0 0.4. This is equal to 92. And what is the unit of mass according to the formula? Mass of solute is in grams. So the answer to this question is 92 grams of solute. Our last example is example 3. The concentration of acetic acid in a vinegar sample is 5% M over V. What volume of the sample contains 4 grams of acetic acid? So acetic acid is our solute. We will still use the formula. This time, we are given percent mass over volume, which is 5%. So 5 is equal to the mass of solute is also given 4 grams of acetic acid. So 4.00 divided by the volume of solution, which is missing in the problem. So just put volume of solution and then times 100. Don't forget the times 100. So we will solve the volume of solution. So to do that, we divide both sides of the equation by 100. So 100 will cancel on the right side. And what remains on the right, right side is 4.00 divided by volume of solution. And on the left side, 5 divided by 100, that is 0 0.05. Next is to multiply both sides of the equation by volume of solution. So volume of solution will cancel on the right side, and what remains on the right side is 4. And on the left side, we have volume of solution times 0 0.05. Now divide both sides by 0 0.05. So 0 0.05 will cancel on the left side. So what remains on the left side is volume of solution. And on the right side, 4 divided by 0 0.05, that is equal to 80. And what is the unit of volume in the formula? The unit is ml. So the volume of solution is 80 ml.